They're both mounted in place and solid. They're very strong. So it's gonna make for a good support for a base for a bed and for a table. In the winter of 2020, Root Dull Sol faced down the barrel of destruction. In addition, the entire world plunged into a collective fog, halting our journey. Despite the chaos these events have brought, with our technology partners, Sun Power and Galt Energy, we're ensuring that these difficulties turn into opportunities to be a better and more united solar community. We're proud to bring you this latest series from the specialist workshops of RRS Race Prep. Together, we're going to demonstrate our commitment to seeing a better tomorrow by engineering solutions to problems of the past and pushing the limits of what is possible. Welcome to Root Del Sol 2.0. We have our two actuators cut to length. They're both moving up and down very smoothly now, which is super awesome and solid. They're very strong. So it's gonna make for a good support for a base for a bed and for a table. Basically what I need to do is I need to mount a mid rib on the table to join these two together. They're nice and straight, which surprised me. I'm not usually very good at getting them straight. You can't really see it from where you are. I'm basically going to cut two sides of this tube out, the square tube. I'm going to put a bolt through the tube and through this center bracket. And then we're going to be able to get our up and down movement. Anyway, I'm done explaining it. I'm going to swap over to time-lapse so that you can see this all happening in action.
I'm gonna cover this in wood now. That's about as simple as that explanation needs to be. No technicalities at all. So three, two, one, time lapse. Finally, it was time to install the table and see how it all fit together. Starting with grinding a curve on the mounting bracket of the actuator for a smooth fit. It's actually amazing how much work goes into such a short video. From the hours of physical work all the way to editing and producing these videos. I never really feel so good about drawing the length of the video out just to make it longer. So I apologize about these videos being so short. I try my best to get all the details of these individual builds together, but I just can't put 20 minutes of me cutting wood and grinding metal. I did, however, slip this last cut of a smaller table that you saw me building in previous videos. How random. Alrighty then. I am so not in the light. Let me fix this camera angle. So that's a wrap for today. I've got the table with wood on top of it. But yeah, pretty stoked with the project, the table project, inside the van. I'm looking around, there's a bunch of stuff left to do. But that's, yeah, that's that for this part of the project. So don't forget to like, subscribe, so you can follow along to this build. And then when I get back out on the road, you can follow the adventure, the solar powered electric adventure down to Argentina. It's gonna be loads of fun. But yeah, that's it for today. I'll see you all in the next video.